Jason and Knox. Today is Tuesday, October 3rd, 2023. Elise, Daniel, and I are happy to share today's news with you. We are from Ms. Bertonson's third grade class. Let's start by pledging allegiance to the flag of our great United States. Please stand, place your right hand over your heart, and we'll begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please return to your seats. Sunny skies are expected today in Olmsted Falls and the temperature will reach high of 82 degrees. Now, Elise, Elise for more today's news. The cafeteria will be, ex will be preparing a great meal for you to enjoy today. If you are buying a hot lunch today, you can choose either Asian to go or chicken patty. And now for this week's Bulldog Buck winners and perfect returns in the library. All right. Good morning. It's Tuesday, October 3rd. Yes. Tuesday. Yes, Tuesday. So it's Officer Bob here. Yes. If you don't have noticed me in my uniform. Um, it is, uh, we have a, I have to read this to you about um, Mrs. Scott. Yes. I have the joke for the day and perfect. Um, library returns. That's right. I have two, and they're on the same class. Uh, are they? Are they in? You well, mean like grade level? Grade level. All right. Yes. So two are the they? Are grade they first level. grade? Negative. Are they third grade? Negative. <gasps> they're both in. Oh, sorry. Both in both second, in second grade. grade. <laughs> I want to get a nice job on the second graders, and one of the classes have done it twice. Two yeah. weeks yeah, two in, weeks in, in a, a row. row. So I'm pretty excited wow. about that. So the perfect returns today is Mrs. Stats. Oh, new class. Yes. And Mrs. Gamo. Wow. That's her second time. Good job, second graders. I gotta work on my first graders and my third graders to get these returns in. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Now yep, yep, yep. Mrs. Scott wants me to read this to you real quick here. Um, it's all about saying hello. To people. Oh yes. Okay. Which is say important. Hello. It's very important to say hello in the mornings. Good mornings, everybody. You walk by, just say hello or good morning. That's right. I, I do it all the time. Where my well, see the sign. By. The sign says, "See someone alone." Yes. Reach out and help, and start with hello. That's it. So I'm gonna read this real quick here. Miss Scott visited the first grade classroom in the last couple of weeks to talk about start with hello. Mm. To teach you about including others, the second and third graders, let me tell you a little bit about the simple program too. So first and second, second and third, so they didn't do this last year? No, this is oh, a new program. This is all new. Nice. Yep. I like this. Well, they did a little bit, but I think she added oh, okay. to it. This is all about noticing when someone is alone, reaching out to help, and just starting with hello. Mm. Check out the VIS video about how you can reach out to include others during arts and crafts. Mm. Is there a video that they see? There is. So we'll do the video after the joke. Okay. So the video is after the, the joke. The video is after. So it's going to be all about arts and crafts and helping out. Okay. I like it. So there you go. Now. It's kind of my thing. And the joke is. Dun, 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 it's, don't it's, bring your glasses. It's, it's different. It's don't a different joke. Button. But I don't have a hat today. But I do have my glasses. I wear these when the sun's it's, very bright. That's right. It's readers. It's like... It's <laughs> boy sporting in the patrol okay. truck there. This is what I drive around in when the sun is bright. <laughs> oh, my God. I like these little little horns. Yeah, I, I do, too. I'm going to make them a double. Yeah, yeah. I like it. I like very it. Very nice. Very, very good. good. So, um, this is... Uh, it's okay, joke, but... Okay. I'm getting there. I got to be able to see it, though. <laughs> what falls but never needs a bandage? What falls but never needs a bandage? Oh, I don't know what falls but never needs a bandage. The rain. Oh, yeah, the rain falls. Yeah, yeah. it does. It falls all the time. I was thinking leaves. 
Yeah, well, there's it could be a leaves. two. It could be leaves. It could be yeah. snow. Could be snow. Yeah. Anything yeah, this is a multi-part question, I yeah, think, but never needs be, to manage. I like it. the rain. So. All right. Okay, so after this, you'll see the uh, video? That's right. Okay. And you'll see the video about reaching out. Reaching out and saying, saying hello. hello. To All right. somebody that's alone. All right? That's right. So everybody get on board with this, and uh, we'll see you in the hallways and lunchroom. You guys have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye. Okay, go. All right, so we've got one thing here. Yep, yep, we yep. we got this basket. We're putting Mrs. Gamo and Mrs. Stotts' names in this basket. And for perfect returns. For perfect returns, and you get a special guest, and you might get a prize. Ooh. When I sh never know who shows up. Or okay. what they bring when they or show up. Or what they bring. Yeah, what That's they bring. right. And what they bring? Um, so we'll be doing this at the end of the month of October. Yep. Okay. So this is all going in. Here we go. We're Here we go. Hold it so everybody sees, and then we'll draw. Okay. There, there you go. go. The right. more you're in there. The more you're in, the more. Options. The more you have a chance well, to win. That's correct. All right. We'll see you later. Right, bye, guys. Bye, bye. Hello. Today is Arts and Crafts Day. My favorite. The teacher asked everyone to work in groups on an art project. Huh. Something here doesn't look right. Do you see it? Malik is the only one no one sat next to for the group art project. Can you remember a time when you felt left out? Do you think Malik is feeling that way right now? When you see someone alone, reach out and help. Let's see if Malik's classmates do that. Hello, Malik. What's up? Do you want to sit with us? Um, I don't know. Oh, I like your drawing. I could use help with mine. Come on, we can work on our drawings together. Yeah, okay. I'll come sit with you. Reaching out to a student who is feeling left out can help them feel happier. What are some other ways you might reach out and help Malik? If you're ever not sure where to start, just start with hello. Remember to always be your bulldog best for your chance to hear your name announced. That's our news for today. Have a terrific Tuesday and, and let's go, go Falls!